Several patrons at a local theater had their vehicles vandalized overnight. And now business operators are being encouraged to step up their security detail. Our Charisma Robinson spoke to one outraged victim today. Jacqueline Smith McPhee did not want to appear on camera, but she's one of many whose vehicle was broken into Monday while catching a late night movie at Galleria Cinemas, John F. Kennedy Drive. But she and her husband's holiday movie date was completely ruined when they realized thieves had smashed in the right window of her brand new BMW Mini Coupe and stole her handbag. Total love of valuables that were in there, including my passport. I had monies in there, so everything valued to over $700. My, my vehicle is a BMW Mini Coupe, and the side that they damage, I actually have to order that. You know, I, it has to be ordered, and like right now, I don't know how much it's going to cost. So, you know, these guys put you in, put you in expense. Business operators are now being encouraged to step up their security initiatives. Police confirmed that at least five vehicles parked at the R&D Plaza were broken into between 10.30 last night and 1 o'clock this morning. Officer in charge of the South Central Division Superintendent Philip Wilson says police are investigating these matters, but business owners must do their part. Um, proprietors must come to the realization that the time is now for them to hire security personnel in their respective parking lots. The Royal Bahamas Police Force cannot police every parking lot. Um, we do not have a policeman to post up to on the interior of every parking lot. Police are reminding the public that it is never a good idea to leave personal goods like handbags, laptop computers and cellular phones inside a vehicle. They say it's better to be safe than sorry. Motor vehicle owners must be mindful of when you're parking. You can't expect them to take your purse out. After you don't park, you come out of your vehicle. We have had several instances where um, persons whom we have arrested and all for breaking into poison's vehicle. When they are interviewed, they say, well, we saw the car pull up, and we saw the, the woman take the purse and put it under the seat or in the trunk of the vehicle. All right. So um, if you're going to secure your stuff, by all means, we want you to do it prior to you pulling up to properly park your vehicle. I would ad advise every other woman, leave your bag at home. You know, because even though you're hitting it underneath the seat of the car, the thieves know where to go. Now, if you have information that can assist police with their investigations into this matter, you're asked to contact them as soon as possible. Charisma Robinson, ZNS Network News.